This 25 minute film didn't budge on any of the fundamental components of a filmmaking. How's that? Let me show you. So, Khali Plow is a 2020 short film which follows the story of a 17 year old young girl named Asha who gets fascinated for playing handball. Apparently she is also good at studies, but you will notice that she is not happy about that. The reason being the untalked fact that it's okay to have a passion for something else even if you're topping it another thing. So by now you have noticed that Prajakta Kohli aka Mostly Sen plays the character of Asha. And it's no doubt that she is the centered attention for this film. And surprisingly it was really good from her. Like her acting is one of the major things that will make you feel the beautiful emotions of the film like it will make you smile, the innocence of it, the fear and may also make you teary till the end. My favorite was the innocence part because of how well Prajita Kohli was able to portray that part of that character. And overall this film is so much satisfying to watch. An interesting fact about filming it is that they actually used real locations to film like Asha's house and the school that she studies in. Don't know if that impacted positively or negatively but it was overall put together well enough. Now if I talk about the cinematography and the camera work, I was impressed and happy at the same time. Ready Madam Ji. To see those subtle creative efforts put in in such a short film that they could have gotten away with and it would have been totally fine but they chose to do that adds on a layer of respect from the audiences who really notice these things. Well now if I talk about the most appreciated thing about this film. All you people are singing Mohit songs. You're singing Khali Pulao songs. What is wrong with you? You're singing Khel Se Mail. You're singing Gaavye Bole. You're singing Man Ki Titliya. Again, I didn't think that music would work like this. And believe me when I say this, the music, the songs are really good. They are so good that it again blows my mind that they chose to make these songs for just a 25 minute film. Well, my favorites are these two. Now, coming back to the story itself, uh, first I want to just show you a clip. It's not a typical victory story, you know. It's not that she had to play a game and she won a game and she won a lot of money and she won a lot of money and she won a lot of money in her sports career. It wasn't like that because we have heard stories, we have heard victory stories like that. Here, Asha's victory was very different. She didn't play a game for the game, she didn't play a game for the game, she didn't play a game. And that's what's interesting and unique about this film. That it's not an end-to-end -end solid story, but it is just a moment in a girl's life of being passionate about playing handball. And above all, just to wear the shorts. And it's that sometimes we take a lot of things for granted, which I personally think about a lot. And sometimes it's really important to have content like these to pull us to the ground and tell us how to think, what to think, and, and also refresh the mindset of making movies and films. And now just to end this with a little critique, Prajakta Kohli's language felt and it was out of the place with her Haryanvi language. Alag game ho yo. But it worked out because Asha's character is more about emotional expression than the language. Sarjib, Sarjib please take me to the team, mein le lo, Sarjib. Do you want to win the other team? Huh? Bawdi Chori.